What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, y'all remember I'm playing catch up, okay? So if you see some of these videos, they old already out. I don't care. I got to catch up, all right? But I'm handling my business. So in the meantime, in between time, just enjoy the video. So this video is about um, Lil Mike. He's still talking about the Krishan situation when old dude robbed him for his cameras and everything else, basically. So we about to get into that. At the end of this video, I do have a, a sample of a story time that me and my cousin react to. It is hilarious. We about to get into TikTok story times. Y'all make sure y'all check it out. The full video link will be in the pinned comment. Okay. The full video link will be in the pinned comment. Go to the link. Watch the video. Y'all want me to react to other things, but y'all ain't going to the other links. Tap in. Stop playing. Now let's get into this video. Um, shout out to Hot T.I. Chocolate. Rock. So what happened with the, with the Krishan Rock shit, right? So he had this shit. I was trying to get in contact with her, but he had this shit lined up first. So I went to him directly and I was like, look, bro, I'll pay you bread. Woo -woo. Like I get somebody to pay you. Or I pay you, so you know I'm saying I had a video. He was like, "Cool." The next, I went to his crib and everything. Right, the next day he called my phone like, "Yeah, bro, she only want to do one video." This nigga lied and said she only wanted to do one YouTube video. So I'm like, "All right, bet." So the next, so that no, that same day I wound up going to uh, Lennox. That's the mall. That's like the main mall in Atlanta. I'm in the mall. This is how guy work. I'm in the mall and shit. Right, I go to the mall to buy. I went to go buy the same phone. Right, I was trying to buy an iPhone 15. I got two phones. This is no bull. I got a, I got this phone right here, the screen crack. Let me show you that bitch. I got a, I, and I got a, I got a new phone. The the Apple Store in Linux wind up not having the um. No, they had the phone I wanted. Yeah. But like I'm on my mom account for AT and T, and she got a business account. So when you got a business account, like they need to physically be there or some bull. So I wind up not getting the phone. So my bro, he was like outside in the mall. So I walked out the AT and T store in Linux. I mean the Apple Store in Linux, and I called him. I'm like, where you at? He like, bro, I see Krishan Rock. Ooh, ooh. I'm like, what the. F so I get to run it, I see her. So I went up to I offered her the amount that I offered her. And she said she was she wanted to do the video, right? So the next day, I met up with her. That same night he sh Stop the TikTok, bro. Stop the TikTok. We don't kick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That same that same night. By the way, this is an open mother floor. Y'all got questions. Yeah, we this is this is what we do over that's, here. That's that's I mean, just let him finish what he's saying now. Uh, eh. Same night, I wind up. Uh, he wind up shooting a vid. The next day, I, I mean, how he end up on the same ballot <laughs> or whatever as them two uh, guys. <laughs> I linked up with her, gave her the bread, and I asked. I'm like, "Is it true you only wanted to do one YouTube video?" She told me, "No." What are you I, doing? Like I never oh, said that. She said I never said that. So I'm like, "Okay, this nigga lied, right?" So yeah. the, so that same day, I shot the vid. The vid was only supposed to be from twelve to two o'clock, right, bro? She pulled up on time, but this is no bull. The whole video, Blueface was calling her the whole time, like in jail. You know how yeah, like yeah, she yeah, got yeah, his, yeah, yeah. his her, like his name tattooed on her face and shit. Yeah, that's when they started f***ing with each other again. So okay. I'm like, you know how like niggas sweet talk girls when they in jail. And shit? Blueface owns Christian. Yeah, like yeah, he was like, I won't get back with you. She had on speaker in the video. Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, man, this shit about to go far, right, bro? It's like five o'clock. We like thrills over the time because she kept walking. He said, "Yeah, Blueface owns Krishan. Listen, that is not debatable. It's true, but yeah." And, uh, been on, Unfortunately, on the phone, this nigga. Yeah, being Krishan. Right? At that moment, we literally about to wrap up the video. We got like three minutes left. I see buku niggas masked up. I'm like, what the? F but the, the the crazy part is, every nigga that was masked up, I knew who they was. Like it was his yeah. partners. It was his left hand man and shit. We we get the argument. Within 30 seconds, the nigga came in, grabbed my camera, slammed that bitch. Mm. Then I see Buku niggas strapped up in a bag. I, I ain't gonna lie, at that point, I duck up. Yeah. None of, like, nobody on my team had blitz, because nigga, we in a public building, my nigga. That's like, we in a mall. You can't you can't even bring straps in there. Yeah. So, I ain't gonna lie, I ran off, and all that footage that went viral. I go to Lennox all the time. Strap. Did you talk? You're in a building. Y'all just don't have guns. Y'all better get y'all shit together. Grown ass men. That's when all that shit happened. So you don't got access to none of the footage no more. No, they took my cameras. So why why did uh Krishan go on live with their assistant talking about like they were trying to rob her? Were they trying to rob her? No. They wasn't even that's the thing, they wasn't even trying to do it for money. They did it because they didn't want me to get the video. Like if they was trying to rob somebody, they oh. would've they would have took her chains. So that's, yeah. that's what she made it. They just didn't That's what she made it sound like. I don't know if she said that yeah. shit with a click bit, but why is he talking? But they wasn't trying to rob her. They, they just didn't want me to get the content. They stole all my cameras and shit. They pistol whooped the nigga that casted my girl. So I mean, like, 
Yeah, that shit was insane. Yeah, nah, they they pistol whipped the fuck out of them too. So there's a lot of people, right? Like, look, most of the shit that goes on online, you got to determine immediately whether it's bullshit. Or it's the real deal, yeah, right? Because a lot of shit that people see is just a lot of people. I'm gonna keep it a being like, I, like, bro, I script some of my content, like, bro, all content creators script this. So I'm gonna keep it a being, but that shit wasn't scripted. Like, it's a whole like police report going on right now. Like, that shit is scripted. That shit was real. So, so what is it like for you? So then, why are you talking about it? What you mean? The police report. Why are you talking about? I already it? spoke up on our internet. Is it? Could it jeopardize? It? Who made? No. Who made the police report? Uh, I can't get into that. <laughs> I can't get it yeah. But but I mean So like now You're gonna have people That you you seen it Right away Right the people on IG Commenting Oh you're snitching And shit like that What do you feel I about mean, that I mean to nigga Saying I'm snitching Like I'm not in street Bro about? if I was living like that I, I would've never Man f all that Gang You took my cameras On tape You cost me Like More than $15,000 you run me my money. You know what I'm saying? And if you ain't trying to give it to me, yeah, they at your door. <laughs> ah. Went to the police. He told on himself, if you ask me. He got caught. Because there's still one rule, pimping. Come on now. Nigga, I'm not in the streets, nigga. I'm a YouTuber, nigga. So, like, I don't abide by those rules, dumb ass nigga. Like, what the fuck? Hello? Yeah. And you're, and you're 19 years old, yeah. right? I mean, by the end of the day, I'm not no hoe. Ain't no nigga going to try me. So it's like, at the end of the day, like, niggas can sit down on the internet, but if they see me in real life, they not going to do me nothing then at the end of the day. But one could argue and say they did come and try you, right? Yes, they did. I mean, you could say that. You know that. what I mean? So, like, I they, mean, you could say that. Yeah, but, brother, you 19 years old, bro. You got to understand, you trying to prove you hard. I'm not even trying to prove I'm hard, but I'm saying a nigga ain't going to play with me. But at the end of the day, like, but, in that situation, that was the best way to handle that. But you understood don't got to be explained. You explaining people, telling people all the time, like, oh, ain't nobody going to try me in real life. It's basically asking for somebody to try you. Right. Mm -hmm. like, Facts. No, it, I'm just tired of niggas just talking shit to me you, on the you, internet, you bro. You say that you're a YouTuber, man. man they're going to hate on you regardless. But, but you say fuck what they got to say. That was a good video. Um, I'm not watching the full video, but that was a good clip. Shout out to Hot Tea, Hot Chocolate, like I said. Um, I ain't going to lie. The Island Boys was not needed in that situation. <laughs> like at all, actually. Um... One of them came out and said that they don't hate Krishan because apparently Krishan said, uh, I think when she was live in the car, that um, I don't know what's up with the Island Boys. Like, I don't know why they don't like me or whatever. But, you know, she said what she had to say. Um, I just don't feel like that was needed. I mean, I don't even know how they got on the same docket. I don't even understand that. But anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think about this down in the comment section below. Girl, I don't have much to say because, I mean, this, they are going to keep dragging this. I'm not going to lie. It is what it is. But love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.